What's your name? No. You were in the greatest story ever told musical. Yes. Correct? Yep. And in the videos. And in the music videos. Mm -hmm. And you've been listening to the CD. Mm -hmm. And you've been liking it. Mm -hmm. uh, do you feel like you've learned more about how the Bible fits together? Yep. I definitely, I did not even know that Zerubbabel exists. Episode, <laughs> right. episode nine. <laughs> so tell us, we're about to sing episode eight. Mm -hmm. Do you consider yourself like a professional singer? No, not really, right? No. Me neither. Far from professional. So we're just having two guys having fun singing a song, right? Yeah. Yes, totally. Um, I mean, that's, that's kind of the whole point of the video. Is I know it doesn't look good, but it's not supposed to look good. It's supposed to look like some kids acting out the whole story <laughs> of the Bible. <laughs> exactly. So, Noah, tell us what is, um, what's going on in episode 8. Tell us the story of episode 8. Okay, so episode 8. The pro uh, okay, so this is after the prophets, and people are worshiping idols. Like the begin, like the end of episode four. People were sorry, five judges. People were all over the place, just worshiping idols. Yeah, doing whatever they want. And then God tells them, when the prophets say throughout your idols, do so, or you will be punished. They did not listen. Not. Far from listening, not even close. So they didn't throw out their idols, and God had Assyria conquer them in the north, and Babylon defeat them in the south. And then they came, conquered them, and yep. took them, right? Yeah, and Back then to their homeland. Now they're under. Uh, now they're under Assyria and Babylon's rule, and they can't. They can't worship their idols that they worship. They have to. Do whatever the king says, mm -hmm. or they will get killed or be punished. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then there's a third verse right after they we, we talk about Daniel and Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, and they start. And then it talks about how there's still hope for Israel, and not all hope is lost, and we're all supposed to be crying, "Oh, dude, what are we gonna do? Nothing. Go. Oh, just mm -hmm. sit here and moan." Uh, so they. And they're kind of prophesying about Jesus and how he's going to save us from all of our sins. Yeah, love it. I love it. Good job. Um, can we th how many books of the Bible can we think of that are in episode 8? Any off the top of your head? Uh, well, I, uh, Daniel. Yeah. And... And there are a few prophets in episode 8 too, right? Yeah. Oh, you so there's those? Obadiah. Yep. Ezekiel and Lamentations. Yeah. I'm pretty sure there's more prophets that talk about the hope for Israel. I think that's all in episode 8, though, right? But, yeah. Yeah. Cool. All right, on. Should we sing it? Yeah, sure. Should we sing it together? Yeah. Let's do it. All right. What's the song called? It's called Big Problems because of the big problems that Israel has. That's right. Big problems, big. Problem. 
problems in the palace. Oh no, if they stuck to God's commandments, oh, things would not go easy for them. And they got thrown into a furnace then. That's awesome.